So it's Josh Powell boxing out of the red corner, representing Southway Police Boxing Academy. And it's Matt Thomas boxing out of the blue corner, who's also representing the Southway Police Boxing Academy. Now I believe these guys have boxed three times. I think tonight is their third contest. Tonight okay. is the decider. They're, they're one and one. And oh, yes, of course. And uh, straight away they're getting down to it. The commentators this fight are myself, Keenan Gibbons, and Team GB Super Heavyweight, Delicious Ori. Thomas is landing some good shots. Thomas has really put behind that pressure. Josh Powell se seems that he's composed. Still relaxed there. Powell is taking his shots. He, he doesn't seem phased yet, but he can't keep on taking hard punches like this. The referee for this contest, John Conlan, has had to do nothing yet apart from just stand and watch these two guys slug it out. Good jab there from Powell. I'd like to see Powell use his jab a little bit more. He's, he's yeah, waiting he, a little bit too long right now. This is where he should be pumping his jab out, yes. I think. I feel like he needs to keep Matt Thomas at bay because he's quite dangerous on the inside, as, we can, as we've seen the past couple, well, a few seconds. I think Matt Thomas is one of those type of fighters that if you just let him let him do his thing, he'll just uh, walk all over you. The better defence there from Powell, taking the shots on the gloves. Another good jab there. He's bringing it on now. Good few combinations. Oh, that was another good shot by Thomas, and he's really loading up on those right hands a little bit wild, but he's throwing them with venom. I have to say that was a brilliant round. Very, very competitive. Very, very close. And uh, I'm going to put you on the spot. Uh, delicious. And who do you think won that round? Oh man, I can't. I can't say. Uh, oh god. If uh, okay, if I say for aggression, I'll give it to Matt Thomas for this round. But we'll never know what's going to happen in the next couple of rounds. But just about though, it's 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 very very close. This is a three-round contest. And as I mentioned at the top, these are two boxers from the, the same gym competing. Apparently they're good friends out of the ring, it's just they're, they're one and one at the moment. They, they just wanted a third fight. The, la the decider, the decider, you've got to get the decider in. And uh, talking to people before the, uh, the show started tonight, fans here in Hereford are really excited for this contest and you can see why. Yeah, there are a lot of fans here, aren't there, today? Coming out strong again from both corners. Powell putting a little more pressure this time. I think this is a bit better from Josh Powell. He's throwing a lot more straight shots down the middle. He took one there as he's getting his own shot off though. And he got a, a left hand and he's loaded up. That was a good left hand. Thomas is rocked, but he took the shot well. His legs slightly wobbled there. Has Josh Powell managed to make a breakthrough? Matt Thomas, the older man at 38 years old. Josh Powell, the baby of the contest at 23. It's just pressure, pressure, pressure. That's all I'm seeing in, this, in, to the, in tonight's fight. Great to watch. Another good jab by Josh Powell. I think that's the key for him in this fight. Just keep the jab to break up the attacks of Matt Thomas. Good overhand right there from Thomas. Both fighters still composed. Still very much in the game. Showing no signs of weakness. Good nice straight shot there from Powell. I'm just wondering, is Matt Thomas just tiring just a little you, as you would expect after such a ferocious 
opening two rounds but uh, Josh Powell's boxing seems to be coming into play here yes as you can see here it's looking like it's catching up now to Matt Thomas and as we come to the end of another excellent round and the noise here in this Hereford six form centre is absolutely deafening another brilliant round there very competitive a brilliant round and also just want to mention the uh, the sponsors of tonight's boxing Maverick Stars Trust uh, they are sponsoring the, the boxing they sponsor the local boxing gym um, they also support the veterans across the UK and I believe they've supported you in the past Delicious yes they still support me now and they'll be supporting me throughout my journey they're a great charity giving people from all walks of life the opportunity to reach their potential big shout out to the Maverick Stars the Mavericks Stars Trust founder Charlotte Jiley okay back to this contest I think it's one round each going into yeah. this third and final round um, yeah I would, I would agree with you there Kieran Josh Powell what's he got to do to win this fight now he's going to he's going to put it on him a little bit but make sure he doesn't get too dragged in into a fight And straight away, both these guys go straight back to it. And Matt Thomas is starting this around ground very aggressively. Both on their front foot, both trying to get that one up toe to toe. None of these, both of these men don't want to stand back, stand down. And just remember that this is amateur boxing. These guys don't get paid for this. They are just doing it because they love to fight, they love to compete, they love to force themselves to the limits. True warriors. And they also love to provide entertainment, which they are tonight in the Hereford Sixth Form College. See, Josh Powell is trying to stick to his boxing, trying to keep it long. Whilst Matt Thomas is just trying to get in there, get a little bit scrappy, but it's working for him. Josh caught Matt Thomas with a shot, and Matt Thomas just laughed in his face. <laughs> I'm not envious of the judges who've got to try and score this third round because this has been yes, very, very, very close. Very, very even, very close. Good shot there from Matt Thomas. With a clean right hand there to the temple. I think this fight could come down to whoever wins this last 20 or 30 seconds. Last or so. little push now from both of the fighters could determine who's just about going to pinch it tonight. It's that little bit. Who can give a little bit more? Good shot there by Powell. Move Thomas's head a little bit there. Both fighters now starting to feel the pace, as expected. They've been going, they've been going hard for the, <laughs> for the last three rounds. A huge roar from the fans here, and Thomas is slightly rocked, but he fires back with his own shots. Wow, what a fight! And a massive credit to both those two warriors. And you know I'm going to ask you, uh, Delicious, <laughs> who, who do you think won that? Oh, God. You put me on the spot. Very close bout. Ah, it depends on which, what, what type of boxing you're watching tonight. I'd say if you're looking for aggression, Matt Thomas might, might have just pinched it tonight, but it could have gone either way. We'll find out with the judges in just a moment. But it's right what you said, I mean, this, the judges are at different positions ringside. Some of them may have watched certain shots land and other judges from the other positions might have missed it. So, uh, we wait for our MC. Okay. So, Josh Powell wins the rubber match against Matt Thomas excellent fight well I, deserved and I, I, I wouldn't mind watching that one again as well oh amazing we need a fourth one we need a fourth <laughs> one 